I think from first having symptoms and going to bed, it was about 10 days. I didn't have it badly at all looking back. At the time it felt bad. My temperature was climbing massively and it was the beginning of lockdown and nobody had masks. And my wife was really worried about getting it and literally came in carrying stuff, wearing a Darth Vader mask, thinking it would keep us secure. And you know, I was, I was eat, overheating so much with my temperature that I thought, <laughs> oh my God, he's coming for me. So my experience with COVID actually in the end turned out to be very mild, but in my opinion, was extremely serious. <laughs> I found out about donating plasma by my sister sent me an email about the campaign. She went, oh, maybe you should do this. She was doing it sort of thinking she was very funny because she also knew that I hate needles. And then someone online on Twitter said, you should do this. And I did want to do something. I think a lot of us feel very powerless during this time. And it's nice to be able to do something that actually other people can benefit from. And the truth is, it's, it's an easy way to feel good about yourself because you're not doing anything that hard. You're just lying down and they give you biscuits. They give you biscuits and a lovely drink. You can have tea and coffee. It's a place for tubby middle-aged men to come and give back to society because we've taken a lot. We've certainly eaten a lot. So we are the perfect candidate. Look at that. The thing is, I really want to eat it the way I did in the old days as a kid where you just eat the chocolate around the outside. So this, honestly, is worth it. Oh, God, this is good. Oh, God. That's fantastic. Do you forget how good that is? It is lovely to know that you make a difference, because if nobody did do this, lots of people would really suffer. So it's, it's nice to, to know that you are of use, particularly if, like me, you do a job that isn't of much use. <laughs>